so friends this is macbook air 2013 model and i am using macos sonoma on this actually this macbook air is unsupported even for macos ventura all but i am using macos sonoma on this so in this video i'm going to show you how to install macos sonoma on unsupported mac this is going to be a special video those who want to install macos sonoma on unsupported mac without getting much more delay let's get started to do this process you will need total three things one is a stable internet connection another one is minimum 16 gb usb pen drive and third is some patience First of all just open a browser in the description here you will find a link just open the link and scroll a little bit and here you will find the SMBIOS model which models are supported for macOS Sonoma you can just read this if you want scroll a little bit and here you will find night link open to patch your app Sonoma just click on here and just click on allow and here the download is started you will have to wait here now the file is download completed and it is automatically decompressed just to minimize the browser open finder app and just go to download folder and select the open code patcher and drag it to the applications folder if you have any existing open code then just click on replace okay it is replaced now close it and just go to app drawer and here you will find open code patcher just open it again click on open now it is opened now you can find the version is 6.9 and it is showing macbook air 6.1 this is my model and now here just click on create a macOS installer just click on download installer wait a little bit here and here you will find a list of macOS uh, here also macOS 14 beta that is Sonoma is included just click on here macOS 14 beta and the download will be started you'll have to wait here until the downloading is completed after the download is completed it will validate itself you'll have to also wait here now you have to put the password of your macbook then click on ok it will extract the macOS installer you'll have to wait here now just click on yes now insert a 16 gb pen drive to your macbook the pen drive is shown here and now just click on install macOS sonoma beta select the pen drive and click on yes put the password of your macbook then click on ok it will take some time you will have to wait here now here just click on yes now just click on install to disk now select the pen drive select the efi put the password of your macbook and click on ok now just click on reboot and again click on restart and press and hold the option key on your keyboard now on the screen you will have to select efi boot with the logo of a drive select and click on enter now here you will have to select macOS sonoma beta and click on enter just wait a little bit to boot up now on the screen if you want to upgrade your macbook then just click on sonoma beta hence we are on stable build then we'll have to go to disk utility this will erase everything on the macbook make sure you take a backup click on disk utility and click continue now from the drop down select show all devices now select the apple drive and click on erase put the name of the drive as macintosh hd then format as aaps and GUID partition map then click on erase it will take time you will have to wait here it is done then just click on done and close the utility now click now click on install map for sonoma beta and click on continue now again click on continue then click on agree again click on agree and now just select the macintosh hd drive and click on continue and it will take time to install the mac OS on your macbook you'll have to wait here presently your macbook will restart several times no need to panic now on this stage you will have to set up your macbook as your own now mac OS sonoma is completely installed on your macbook you can see that everything is not working that is graphics driver is not installed is not working it is not showing properly and if you click here here the display brightness option is not also working okay after rebooting your macbook you will find this type of user interface just click on ok then click install on disk now this time select apple ssd that means your macbook ssd then select efi now put the password of your macbook now click enter now just click on ignore and then return to menu now you'll have to click on post install root patch now click on start routing then click on yes again put the password of your macbook now just wait here for a little bit now just click on reboot and again uncheck this and click restart now you can remove your usb from macbook now you have to put the password of your macbook again then click on enter now after restarting a transparent effect on the taskbar and the menu bar also changed to a transparent taskbar now if you click on here you will find the display brightness increase and decrease option is also enabled now that means every driver has been installed after restarting now if you click all about this mac this is macbook air 2013 and i'm using mac os sonoma 14. hope now mac os sonoma is installed on your unsupported mac if this guide and tutorial was helpful then please hit the like button and don't forget to share this video with your friends 
we will meet on another day on another topic till then take care